Hi everyone, Lacey here with the McKay Hill Group again, and today I'm here to run you through the sixth and final workout of the challenge. Congratulations to each of you who have joined and tried each of these workouts, that's awesome. Let's finish really strong here with the sixth workout, and today we're going to do four rounds, five different exercises, and it's going to be a total of 10 reps of each. So let's jump into each of these exercises. You're gonna start with a squat, to press. So push through the heels, drive up through the legs and press. Bring those dumbbells right back down to your shoulders. So you're pushing those hips forward nice and quick. The second movement is a bent over row. So same thing, shoulder distance apart. Bend at the hips, keep that back nice and flat. Elbows close to the body, squeeze. Let the dumbbells come back down nice and easy. Squeeze and back down. That's movement number two. The third movement, similar to the first, except the dumbbell's gonna go out instead of up. So you're squatting, hit the squat, out, in, push back up. Same thing, back down, out, in, and back up. 10 reps total. Fourth exercise is an upright row. Those palms are gonna start facing your body. Elbows lead. Squeeze, control on the way down. Super important that your elbows lead on the way up because that really triggers those shoulder muscles on top there. The last and final exercise, four twists. Have a seat on the floor, chest out, shoulders back. You're twisting, right plus left equals one. You're going to 10. If you need a modification, keep those feet on the ground. Progression, feet up. If you need even more of a progression, grab one of the dumbbells you have here on the side and then hold that at your chest. Twist, twist, bring it back to the center when you're done. Good luck with the sixth and final workout. Thank you for joining us. Have fun.